Fishing in seagrass occurs around the globe. And generally speaking, wherever you get um, seagrasses and people, you get fishing activity. A prerequisite for natural resource management is understanding resource exploitation. But the nature and extent of fisheries and seagrass meadows is, is generally poorly understood. And that's why we decided to undertake a global review of seagrass fishing activity. Seagrasses are plants that grow in the shallow ocean. The seagrass attracts many animals um, that come to the seagrass to live or to feed um, or seeking shelter. And these animals that come to the seagrass are collected by humans for food. Across the globe, people's reasons for fishing are different. In more developed areas, people generally fish for, for recreation um, or these are large scale fisheries. Whereas in more developing areas, people generally fish out of a necessity um, and need to find food or supply livelihoods. In countries with more challenged economies, um, generally these fisheries are vital. Because seagrass grows close to the shore in many areas, it makes it highly accessible, um, either when the tide's in and people are out fishing using methods like nets or hook and line, to when the tide's out and the seagrass is actually there and you can walk across it. Um, and then you find people who are out there on foot collecting animals by hand, usually invertebrates. Um, and that's actually a huge fishery, um, largely undocumented, and that includes men, women, and children. Entire families go out doing this activity, um, it's often referred to as gleaning or invertebrate harvesting. Lots of different gear types are used in seagrass meadows, um, pretty much the whole suite of gear types available. Um, all these different methods to catch um, or exploit green resources are used in seagrass meadows uh, in different places around the world. Seagrass meadows receive limited management attention compared to other nearshore habitats around the globe. Our research highlights that these seagrass fisheries are extremely diverse and widespread. Recent works systematically and scientifically investigated evidence from around the globe um, looking at the scope, the spread, um, and diversity of these seagrass fisheries. And we hope that, that this research can highlight the need for targeted fisheries management within seagrass meadows.